This is this isn't like a Meek Mill Tony story. It's a trilogy though. This is dude telling the story about two friends and what happened. I don't want to spoil the story. I just want you. I'm gonna let you listen to part one and see how that goes from there. Okay. You, you right. want to sit there? Or yeah, you sit there in the middle. You guys are the main characters here. Yeah. yeah. This, is, this, is, this is Rap Man. Uh, Blue Story Part One. I'm gonna let him listen to this right now, and then later on, I might let him listen to the other parts of the trilogy. But he made a, he made a 2015 wrap up. He pretty much wrapped up the whole year in one song. Yeah, yeah. Deep ass really? song. Yeah. But this one, he's telling the story, and the storyline in this one, that shit had me. So I'm gonna let you listen to the first one and see what you think about it. And then right. Right, later on, when we continue the barbershop edition. Yeah. With Cat and George, we'll see what they think about the rest. So let's listen to the first one. Rap Man, Blue Story Part One. <laughs> Before we settle down, let's run free. America. And this thing gets deep, man. Now it's all stress, sometimes when things change, it ain't always for the best. Things used to be blessed, and now it's all stress. Sometimes when things change, it ain't always yeah. for the best. See, Timmy was 11 years old. He just left praying, was feeling kind of bold. His secondary school was outside his own bits. But if you ask him what's beef, he say you have it with your chips. A little young boy is not yet mature, and his mother wanted to know the postcodes was at a war. She just sent us out to school. The Ofsted said that it was cool. She didn't know what he was about to go through. Let me tell you how it went. See, Timmy had a group of close friends, and every day in school you hung around with them. Your dolls were with boys, on the bus they were always making up noise. Young kids in life just trying to enjoy it And ain't nothing wrong with that His family never had a lot of cash Yeah, he's always been the opposite of Flash But he knew how to scrap And plus he told jokes and all that Overall he was a popular lad But things were soon about to change See, one day his boy came to class I had bust and his arm in the cast Timmy's like, what the fuck? Marco's like, I got jumped Timmy's like, by who? Seven guys from your pots On the weekend I went there to link a chick And they moved to me straight and said I'm not from the bits Next I know I'm getting hit with a brick And the time I woke up, I was looking like this Man, they broke my fucking wrist You can see Tim was pissed Marco's like his best friend, he hate had to be him He told his boy Marco, you know I've got your back Marco screwed him in his face and then turned his back Tim is like, what's wrong? Marco's like, what you mean? The man are from your end, so that means you're on their team I'm a peckin' boy and you're a GB That's two different sides, so that's you against me Timmy look back, Marco, are you mad? Since when do me or you represent any gangs? You're saying that's my team, well that's all news to me It's always been me, you, D and the King I don't know them ghetto boys, they're just a gang from my end You don't know them peckin' boys, they're just your older brother's friends You got messed up, I understand that you're pissed But me and you been close from when I left year six When I had 20 pounds, I gave you a bench And now you're going on like we ain't ever been friends Never mattered before that we're from different ends So you say Saying this now don't even make no fucking sense Marco knew that he was right Timmy told no fucking lies Five years that's been his way He didn't want to say goodbye Hey, hey, what's going on, buddy? Um, shoot Chris, call me, Chris, call me back in five minutes I'm in the middle of filming something right now Five minutes, all right? All right, peace All right, so you get the story so far? Yeah, 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 yeah Timmy and Marco were friends I think Marco went to Timmy's ends, ends of the area but, And... Marco got jumped by people from Timmy's ends, but you know they're not in gang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but Marco yeah. sees that uh, that Timmy people jumping him, so that's where the friction started. Mm-hmm. Because they should have looked out for him. No, but the thing is, Timmy didn't know Marco was there. Oh. Yeah. So Marco just went there, and he happened to get jumped by people from Timmy's gang, but Timmy isn't in a gang at the moment. He just lives in the area. Oh, but those oh, are people from his area that yeah. jumped his best friend. So, so that, you're saying that Marco is saying that Timmy should have done something? Marco is saying that it's because your people jumped me. Yeah, that I'm gonna go against you now. Oh, so Marco's, Marco's people is like GB or something, and yeah. Timmy's people are this. But both of them aren't in gangs. Right? They're not in gangs. They're yeah. not. He just happened to get jumped by the people in Timmy's area. Yeah. So. Like, you know, young kids, they don't really look at things fully. 
So he went against Timmy, his best friend, because he got jumped by people in his area. But Timmy had nothing to do with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right, Timmy all right. Timmy had nothing to do with it. Because I said, why is he yelling at him? I thought it was his homeboy. Yeah, Timmy Wait. had nothing to do with it. He didn't want to say goodbye, but his older brother told him that it's time for him to ride. And you can't trust a man that's from the other side. If you look behind the pain, you can see the sadness in his eyes. Timmy's always been that man by his side, but he's made up his mind. He looked him dead up in the eyes, and from now on, I'm no longer your guy. Timmy wanted to speak, but he still had his pride, so he moved to the left and let Marco walk by. R.I.P. Man, that friendship just died. All because the council housed them on different sites. Sad fucking times. Are you deaf, boy? I said, sit down. After that, things just weren't the same for Tim. All the kids around school were acting strange to him. To the school was in peck and they weren't siding with him. An outcast in the place where he used to be king. Plus, Marco's older brother, they all knew about him. He banged guns and sold drugs, they weren't fucking with him. The worst thing about it, Tim, he hasn't done anything. But you know, kids are, they like to follow what's in. One day, when Tim was going home, he was sitting at the bus stop, playing on his phone. A car pulled up, the windows all black, five men jumped out, they was wearing all black, a couple balaclavas, hoodies and some caps, Timmy tried to run but they hit him in the back, he fell to the ground, they tried to stamp him out, the tempers weren't tiny, tried to make him pass out, but just before he did, he caught a little glimpse of one of the attackers who let his hood slip, eyes about to close, heart about to break as he watched the way Marco smash a brick on his face, eyes fully closed, head feeling gone, blood upon his face, fingers feeling numb, Saying to himself, Marco's so fucking dumb, but if he ever wakes up, it's gonna be on for everyone. Oh. Eyes fully closed, head feeling gone, blood upon his face, fingers feeling numb. Saying to himself, Marco's so fucking dumb, but if he ever wakes up, it's gonna be on for everyone. Are you sure just having the last bit, right? Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy, man. Yeah, so Marco and up. his boys oh, oh, went and jumped Timmy. Timmy. But Timmy's just an innocent yeah, boxer. Yeah, Timmy, that's the thing. It doesn't do anything. Yeah, so Timmy's the one who got jumped first, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah Timmy. Timmy got jumped by yeah. people and Marco. Was See, Timmy, Timmy, hold it. Timmy, bitch, because he wasn't supposed to go back and do his partner. Doesn't he? he just his partner got to stand aside while he go back and handle his business. Yeah, so, but you see the thing is. When they're young, he's like, oh, these are people from your area, yeah. and they jump me. So you never ain't got nothing to do with your man, though. Yeah, but he was, you know kids don't think like that sometimes. They just, I, I thought like that. I'm about, I'm about to say, <laughs> like, like, oh, you're the kind of kid. But, but, that's, but, but this, that's what I was going to say. You uh -huh. lose me when you say this, because kids don't think. I was about to say, well, I thought like that. Yeah, because yeah, 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 my, my people come in there and say, look, dude, yeah. your people did this. I'm going to handle my business. Just stand aside. You ain't got nothing to do with that. That's how and he got to stand aside. Yeah, but you ain't even thinking about it. You're like, oh, this is your people. people. That's it. Oh, your people, people is you. Is that yeah. how young kids think these days? Yeah, man. Look, if you get, if you're best, if you're best friends with someone, yeah. and their people jump you, you're like, yo, your people jump me. That's your people against me. That's you against me. So they don't really think about you know, even, even though it had nothing, it had nothing to do with you. But you got to tell your people, you got to let them know If this man won't do something, y'all can't look for me. Because they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't go in depth or sensitive. They don't so, think about it like, yo, so. my homie didn't really, this is, like, you know, yeah. they, if you look at it, friendship gets thrown away so fast in high school, bro. Yeah. Over one little, oh, he talked to my girl, they, they get mad and they throw it away. You don't so, like they like. That's yeah, all. if somebody gets jumped like that, yeah, then they just look at it like, oh, you got jumped on me, so let it go. They like a man, they like, they ain't got dad Yeah, they just let go of that friendship, They think it emotional. Because, you know, he was. Yeah, they don't got, they not grounded. No disrespect, but we call that bitch man. Yeah, it's all good. That's just really what it is. They not grounded. You got pops at home. It's all that and you guys yeah, say that, the people who, who, who he got jumped, but the people in his gang are like, yo, Burn. these people jumped you, so up, you gotta go what's against up? the person that jumped. Yeah, what's up, bro? <laughs> it's, it's, it's a freaking yeah, yeah, man. Thing, man. Yeah, that's rap. Oh, what's, what's up, bro? 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 What you doing? <laughs> <laughs> what you doing? All right, all right, that would be that's that's it for this one. Yeah, no, I I rock with the story, rap man. It's, yeah. it's gonna get deeper though. I'm not gonna say what's oh, gonna yeah, happen next show. Oh, there you go. That ain't nothing. All right, that's it for, for this one. Two Blunt TV, make sure you follow George. You got to show your face, George. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there Instagram, Real Estate George. How's your boy? My barber, Cap. Cap, baby. 
gonna whip up my hair. Can't show y'all that though. Mouth all good. 